We are live. Confirm that we are live, yeah. Okay. There we are. All right, guys. So today, like I said, I have a live interview with uh, one of my mentors, um, Vinny Strathers. Um, he uh, introduced me to email marketing and internet marketing. And also, uh, we have a little surprise of another way of marketing that I've never even thought of. So, all right, Vinny, take it away. All right, all right. Thanks, Bobby, for having me. Uh, I really appreciate this. Um, uh, so before I want to get started, guys, let me introduce myself. My name is Vinny. I'm originally from Los Angeles, okay? Uh, born and raised. Uh, I reside in Ohio right now. I've been here for about three years. Uh, my wife is from here. That's the reason why I came here. It's a lot slower pace of life. And um, <clears throat> I have three children. Uh, I have a, a, a offline business, which I run full time, which is a moving company. And also I have a lawn care company that I run. So I have a group of guys that work for me. And I've, I've been doing that for about three years now, full time. Um, <clears throat> um, so before I got started in Internet marketing, guys, uh, a lot of you uh, have been in a network marketing company. So I got my start at early 2000. And uh, it was for a company called Tahitian Noni. Uh, it was a, a fruit drink that tasted horrible. Uh, but there was a lot of people that were making a lot of money with this beverage. Okay, uh, So when I got started, guys, I completely failed. OK, and I failed for years upon years. OK, and it, the, the reason why I failed is because uh, at that time, guys, I didn't have the right target uh, market. All right. Uh, people that I was targeting that was around my age, they weren't interested and starting a network marketing business, right? And I, I think I was too afraid to approach people that were older than me, that were in, in better positions, so to speak, <clears throat> that um, it, didn't, it didn't work for me. I, I didn't see it working for me. Uh, I knew that network marketing was uh, a huge business. It, it got me excited. Um, the leverage that you were able to build, the ability, uh, the financial freedom to work from home, live life on your terms. I know I wanted that for myself. I always had that entrepreneur spirit ever since I was a young kid. Uh, I would sell candy in school. Uh, I was always selling something growing up, eBay, um, yard sales, whatever I could do to make an extra buck. That's what I did. So I always had that in me. And so <clears throat> um, years went on and, you know, working a job, uh, it was Got, I got to a point where I totally got fed up working for someone else. I just couldn't do it anymore. So um, I was a delivery driver for a very long time for a furniture company, a high-end furniture company called Stick Stickly. And uh, uh, I decided that I wanted to uh, start a business in that field, but I just didn't know what type of business. So whenever we would deliver furniture to someone's home, they would always ask me, hey, uh, if you can move our, this sofa uh, to the um, to our basement or maybe outside to the curb, I'll give you a couple bucks. And I said, sure. Well, you know, I never turned down any money, free money. Right. So that gave me an idea to start a business. So I, I said I can start an in-house moving company where we move furniture and rearrange furniture within your house. Right. So that's what I did, guys. I started a business, a moving company, but we specialize in moving furniture within your home. So we'll come to your home. We'll move your, if you want your bedroom moved around or a sofa taken to your basement or to your attic or outside to your curb or wherever, we will come to your house and move your furniture around. So I've been doing that again for the past three or four years. Been very successful here. And, uh, Back in 2017, I had the bug to get back into internet marketing, okay? Uh, throughout the years, I would try different programs, but nothing really clicked for me. And the reason why is because I didn't take the time to do the right things in my business, right? I didn't know what the next step was. I would join a business and then 
Um, I didn't know what the next step was. I didn't know how to generate traffic. I didn't know how to set up an auto responder. I didn't know how to uh, design a lead capture page. I didn't know any of that, right? People would always tell me, you always hear other top marketers say, hey, you need an auto responder. These are the tools you need in order to succeed in business. And at that time, I just didn't believe you needed those tools. I was too stubborn to actually go get those tools. And it really bit me in the butt because um, nothing worked out for me. So back in 2017, um, I said, I'm going to use the same marketing strategies that I use in my offline business and apply it to my online business, right? So as running a business, you learn different marketing tactics and things that you have to do to generate customers, right? So uh, what I said is, I am going to uh, to build, I seen that you, in this day and age, you need to have an audience, okay? You need to have followers. You need to build your email list. So I said to myself, uh, I'm gonna document every single day for 90 days uh, what I do in my online business, right? Uh, I said, this is gonna help me build my audience. I wasn't focusing on the results of making money, um, but eventually money did come, but that wasn't my main focus. My main focus was to build my email list and to build my following, okay? So uh, I decided uh, I'm gonna uh, get an autoresponder, uh, which I already had for my off offline business, but I was gonna get another one for my online business. I decided I'm going to learn how to build a capture page. So there was this company that was uh, around called Builderall. I'm sure many of you heard Builderall. Uh, it's like a, um, a digital platform where you can build landing pages, websites. It comes with an autoresponder. And so uh, it has an affiliate program. So I decided, hey, I'm going to sign up for Builderall. And this is what I'm going to promote online. So every day for 90 days, guys. I documented what I did in my business, all right? And guess what? My following started to grow, right? Eventually, I started to make money with this business. And um, my, my email list continued to grow. Um, I, I built a capture page. Um, and my title for the capture page at the time was Retire in 90 Days. So that was my whole focus. I came up with a plan. I wrote it down and I decided to take action. I said, I'm going to promote this uh, this landing page and this is going to help me build my email list. So I built my email list, started building my following. <clears throat> and eventually I started making money with this system and I started showing my results. Uh, people like to see results. So in the beginning, you may not have income results and that's totally fine. But document your process. What are you doing in your business? People want to see that. That, that's what people like to watch on YouTube. People like to see other people doing things in their business to help build their business. Even if you're not getting results, just document the process, okay? That's going to help you be successful if you document the process. So that's what exactly what I did. Um, and then um, I was approached by a gentleman that I know online, and uh, he said, uh, there's a new program coming around, an instant pay affiliate program that I decided to join, okay? And with this program, guys, um, I was, th throughout the 90 days, I was learning how to build a following. I was learning how to rank my YouTube videos, right? So when I decided to join the program, I decided, hey, I'm going to try to um, – outrank everybody for that key term, all right, $25 one up. I'm going to try to make as many videos as I can so when people see my face, they're related to $25 one up. And guess what, guys? I made my first $10,000 in one month with that program, all right? All because of building my following, continue to build my list, and uh, ranking my YouTube videos, all right? So, uh, it can happen for you too, guys, if you put in the work, but you must plan. You have to plan this out. You have to plan what type of videos you're going to make. You have to document your process, all right? And that's the same strategy I use to this day. Um, uh, what questions did you want to ask me uh, regarding... Uh, 
the twenty five dollar one up program, Bobby. Or you just want to? Yeah. Um, just kind of curious. I have no idea what that what that is actually. Um, okay. And just explain to us, like, what is that? Okay, so twenty five dollar one up <laughs> is an affiliate program. Okay, it's an affiliate program, a marketing system, and training platform. Okay, so it comes with pre built. Uh, landing pages or capture pages, whatever you want to call them, uh, has an uh, in-house autoresponder, uh, but it has training videos that teaches you uh, how to build uh, your online marketing business, uh, but it also <clears throat> allows you to make 100% instant commissions ranging from $25 all the way up to $500, depending on what level you decide to get started with, okay? Um, some of you may have heard of it, some of you may have not, uh, but it, it was pretty big early in 2018. Uh, it still goes, the program is still in effect right now. People are still making money with it. I, st I still continue to make money with the program. Uh, but it was one of the programs that uh, people like because it's simple. Right? It's easy to understand, it's not complicated, and uh, it, it really worked out for a whole lot of people. I see. And I guess another question I would have is how how would you drive traffic to that particular offer? So um, one of the things that I, I did was YouTube videos. OK, so one of the things that I did is create my own funnel. All right. And, uh, and to brand myself, a lot of people use company built funnels and they're branding the company. But if you join an opportunity like that, you want to brand yourself. So I built a simple two page funnel, um, which with an enticing headline and then a bridge page and the bridge page. I just simply uh, talked about the company um, and also offered bonuses. OK, so I, I gave them people an incentive to want to join me uh, by offering a bonus. So one of the things that I did was I put together a traffic co-op that you're a part of right now, okay? It was called Traffic School Co-op. And what we do, we all buy traffic on a weekly basis and uh, all the clicks get distributed equally among its members. So I was already doing that. I had the Traffic School Co-op going. So uh, one of the bonuses that I had was, uh, if you would join me at a certain level, uh, you will get uh, so many weeks free within Traffic School Co-op. Okay, so I gave people an, an incentive to want to join me than the average Joe, Susan, Larry, you get what I'm saying. Um, so yes, yeah, I actually didn't even take advantage of the traffic school co-op. I didn't even realize. Yeah. I, I just went through your the group and you had valuable training of how to, you know, different ways of marketing. Yeah. Um, just just interject. Yes, that's that's actually how I discovered you. Learned about okay. you actually your, your YouTube video. Nice. Uh, something that you reviewed, and I was like, "Oh, I, I can relate to you." And and yes, to join your group and get that traffic school was definitely one of the bonuses that I enjoyed. So I was like, "All right, I'm gonna go with you." Because like I said, there was like ten other videos that reviewed the same thing. Yeah. Uh, for some reason, you resonated, and <clears throat> and that traffic school co-op Facebook group attracted me to you. So nice. It actually works. <laughs> yeah, it does work because. Um, my biggest thing, I, I want to give value to people, right? Uh, there's a lot of people that want to withhold information. I don't see the benefit of withholding this information if it, if it can benefit you. Um, one of the things that I, I teach in, in the traffic to school co-op is how to generate traffic. A lot of people just don't know how to generate traffic. And I, I teach five simple ways, and I still use these five ways, right? Um, you. So you must have a couple free ways to generate traffic and you must have a paid way to generate traffic. So some of the things that I teach are uh, video marketing, how to generate traffic with video marketing, with your Facebook post, okay? We talk about Facebook ads. We also talk about direct mail, okay? And last but not least, solo ads. So those are the five ways that I have built my business to what it is right now. And I continue to do that. <clears throat> Um, and actually, what, what's the best strategy 
out of the five that you got more leads out of or anything that um that are that's different for anyone else i know that when you said direct mail marketing i completely didn't even realize that we can do that with this type of business you want to yeah. just elaborate on that yeah sure so one of the best ways um and get, continues to be the best way to generate traffic is videos videos are everywhere instagram youtube facebook uh, people are always watching videos on that on their phone. Okay, uh, so one of the best ways you can use to do this is start to create videos. Uh, people, a lot of people are afraid to get in front of the camera. I know I was in the beginning. Uh, you're going to mess up, but you can't think about that. You just have to put yourself out there. People need to see your face, and they need to see your face often so that can you can build that no like trust. All right. Once you build that no like trust, uh, people are going to spend money with you. Plain and simple. Uh, but there's other ways to generate traffic. So uh, one of the things that I use is direct mail. I use direct mail in my offline business and I also use it in my online business. Direct mail is not going anywhere. Direct mail has been around for over 300 years, okay? It's not going anywhere, okay? People will always go to their mailbox and read their mail. Always. Everyone goes to their mailbox and they will get their mail. So if you have something that captures their attention um, <clears throat> and they're ready to take advantage of it, they're gonna take advantage of it, okay? So uh, one, let me show you some direct mail pieces that I actually use. All right, so here's one direct mail piece, okay, that I use for my um, home care business, all right? And on the back, um, it's just some information they can get okay and also a coupon that i use um, but simply uh something like this when you get this in your mailbox guys it's huge it's big and you're it's going to capture your attention okay even if you don't take advantage of it you're going to put it down and you're going to read it you're going to read it so uh that's one of the ways that i, I capture your prospects attention and i'll always direct them to a website where i can capture their name and email address so I'm continually building my um, email list, right? Because you need to follow up with your prospects. They may not take advantage of the offer now, but it may be something in the future uh, that they may take advantage of. And I'm, I'm always able to follow up with my prospects. Uh, here's another one I did for the $25 one-up program. Okay. Uh, I use jumbo postcards. They're a little more costly, uh, but... I want to capture my prospect's attention. Uh, here's another one I did for the $25 one-up program, just showing some proof. Uh, I actually show them how to get their first sale with the, within the first 72 hours. Uh, here's one for my moving company. As you guys can see. And uh, I offer a lead magnet, okay? So uh, what a lead magnet is, is simply uh, something of value you give away for free. So one of the things that I do offer for my moving company is a, a, a ebook. Okay, it's called the Consumer's Guide to Choosing a Mover, and it simply explains uh, how you want to choose a moving company when you're deciding to move. So that's something that I give away for free. Uh, that's going to help me what build my email list. Building your email list that is the key if you really want to truly be successful online. If you want to make six to seven figures online. You have to build your email list. Again, if you're not building your email list, you're wasting your time online. Plain and simple. You're wasting your time online. So um, I just want to show you this last one that I, that I use for one of my uh, direct mail businesses. All right, that's me and my wife there in Maui. And then on the back of it is just a little story and a picture of myself and a, a a uh, call to action to my website where again I'm building my email list. So that's one of the ways that I use direct mail again to build my list so I can follow up. Fortunes in the follow up. Wow. All right, man. Let me just recap this. It, okay. So what you're saying is you use direct mail and guys, if you guys I don't I've never heard of this in the internet marketing space, like to use direct mail to advertise 
And also another nugget I, I heard was you using that to give them a lead magnet to get their contact info. That guys, that's that's the best way to actually get someone to get give away you know their information. It's through giving giving value. Yes. Um, Vinny, you're the man, man. Like, Thank you. I, I've never even thought about like doing direct mail. That just mind is blown. It's crazy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I know we were talking before that too. I was just like, wow, how? Like, at first I was like, direct mail, like, no one does that, right? Yeah. But, like, if you connect everything, like YouTube, Facebook, direct mail, and even giving a lead manic through direct mail. Yes. Um, so, yeah, guys, if you guys are here live, hashtag live. If you guys are here in the replay, hashtag replay. And if you think Vinny had brought all the value, just show us some hearts, guys. Likes, hearts, and share. Yes. But um, please. Definitely, definitely valuable because I I've never seen anyone share direct mail marketing. Yeah. I anywhere mean, in our space. It, yeah, that, that's why I continue to use it. I've been using it right now heavily uh, for the past uh, year and a half, and I've seen a lot of results with direct mail because. Uh, with direct mail, you're reaching an audience that's not necessarily uh, on Facebook all the time, on YouTube all the time, on Instagram. And uh, these are mainly when you're using direct mail, you, you have a target market. OK, you can target whoever you want. But um, I find that people that are 30 years of age to 54, it's going to be your target market for direct mail. And these are the people that are established. Uh, they have families, uh, they have careers, so they have a little bit of money set aside. So they, they're either interested in spending money for your know, products or service, or they're looking to make extra money with a business opportunity. So uh, these are the people that you want to target with direct mail, and you will see results by using direct mail. Um, one of the things I wanted to mention uh, is in the beginning, one of the things that I did was put together a lead magnet. Now, you may be asking yourself, what kind of lead magnet can I put together, guys? You can put together anything um, th that of value that you find that people are want to be interested in. So you can put together a checklist depending on the, the tools you need for Internet marketing. Uh, you can offer that a, a value. But one of the things that I did was um, – I gave away a PDF that I put together, and the PDF was called 300 Power Headlines That Will Have Leads Chasing You Down Ready to Click, Opt In, and Buy. So here's uh, a preview of it, if you guys can see. And in this PDF, it's just uh, tons and tons of headlines that I put together uh, that you can use, that you can, you know, change the words around and use it for your own uh, business. Okay. Headlines are key. All right. Headlines is what uh, attracts uh, people to you because it, it captures their attention and it creates curiosity. See, that's, that's the one thing that I learned in internet marketing is that you have to create curiosity and grab your prospects attention. All right. And so it's getting a lot harder now to grab your prospects attention because uh, there's so many things that we see on a daily basis uh, that captures our attention, right? Our attention, our attention span is a lot shorter. So you have to have something very enticing and that's going to create curiosity to capture that prospect's attention. So they can want to either uh, read your message or give you their name and email address. So the other question is like, how, how do you learn all this? Like, did you go through a program? Did you go through schooling? Did you go through a course? Okay. And how, how does one learn all about this? At, man, it took uh, years and years of watching YouTube videos and really model, modeling top internet marketers. That's what I did. That's how I got my education. Uh, really taking the time out and, and, looking at the actions of people instead of their words, okay? So what are they doing in their business uh, that's getting them these results, all right? That's what you have to look. When you look at someone, what are what type of actions are they doing in their business to get these type of results? Are they making videos, right? Do they have their own branded uh, lead capture page? And, and uh, are they collecting e names and email? All the top marketers are building their list, right? They're building their following, right? They're making videos. 
right? Because they're uh, getting the attention of the people. That's why people follow them, right? You can't be an internet marketer and hide behind your computer. Uh, that was early 2000s. You could do that. Not anymore, guys. People want to see your face, right? So you have to put yourself out there. Yeah, so I guess my other question is, how do you get into like online business and internet marketing and things like that? Okay. So uh, again, I talked about being in network marketing and that didn't work out for me in the beginning because I didn't have the target audience. So, you know, I went online, I really looked around for different programs, I've seen different programs you can join online. And they always talked about building your business online. And I said, hey, that's a genius idea. Why not build a business online? But at that time, guys, I didn't know how to generate traffic, right? Um, I was too scared to put to put my money into paid advertising because I didn't have a lot of money. I didn't uh, set aside a budget. I really didn't understand business, all right? And business, it takes money to make money. Not a lot of money, but it definitely takes money in the beginning to make money. So you're going to have to spend uh, some money to get the type of results that you want to get a lot faster because going the freeway, uh, it's going to take a lot longer and the results are not going to be immediate. But if you're using paid advertising, uh, you're going to see results a lot faster. It's going to help speed up that process. But combining both, uh, that's the best of both worlds. And that's what you want to do is combine both free and paid advertising. So again, set aside and plan a monthly budget to invest into your business on a monthly basis. All right. Start off where you can start. At. If you can only do $100 a month in paid advertising, do that, but do it consistently. OK. If you can do more, do more, but do whatever you do, make sure you do it consistently, whether it's a free way or a pay way, but the key word is consistently. I see, I see. And how did you learn about like direct marketing? And I guess where everyone would be asking, like how do you get their email address, I mean, mailing address and things like that. I know we can get email address through like, you know, maybe a lead page or yeah. whatnot, but how do you collect their mailing address and things like that? Okay, so you, you have to, you buy leads, okay? You buy, you can buy the names and uh, um, mailing list from different companies out there. So if you go to Google, you type in mailing list, uh, there's mailing list companies out there that collect information, uh, the type of income a person makes, their credit score, whether they live in a house or apartment, their age range, there's so many things you can target uh, to get your uh, mailing list. Uh, you can target for whatever business you want to target for. So that's what I do. I, I'll, I'll go buy leads. Uh, I probably have over 200,000 leads right now that I've purchased with the, within the past year. So, um, one of the things that you do with direct mail, like you do with email marketing, you have to be consistent with your mailing. So people, again, need to see you multiple times before they take advantage of your offer. So what I'll do, if I, if I have a, a, a list of leads, maybe you say about, let's say 100 names, okay? What I'll do is I will send a direct mail piece every single week, okay? The same direct mail piece to every single week, if it's a postcard, to their house every single week guys consistently because again people need to see you five to seven times before they take advantage of your offer so i, I use the same strategies i use for email marketing and i apply that to online offline marketing because um you see better results that way uh, i see i see all right so same it's the same process same same method just doing it different ways got yeah. it um so were there any like mentors or anyone that actually showed you the ropes in the beginning or actually no man i learned all this on on my own again by by youtube and watching other marketers um and well i could say one of my mentors was uh dan kennedy uh, I, I have a lot of his books and also i, I watched them on online talk about direct mail marketing. Um, 
because that's what he was. He, that's what he specialized in. He's made millions and millions of dollars and also helped other people make millions and millions of dollars with uh, direct mail. And um, I don't see a lot of people talking about direct mail uh, because that's it's, it's still a huge open market that nobody's really, really talks about. And you can get a lot of results. Uh, the only thing about direct mail, it can be very costly because of the postage. All right. It can be very, very costly. So uh, you have to start off uh, small in the beginning and work your way up. So once you have enough capital, then I would advise you to get, in, get involved in direct mail. OK. But if you don't have a lot of cap capital, stick with the uh, online uh, traffic sources. Yeah, you mentioned, you know, he was your early mentor. People don't realize that, you know, your mentor doesn't have to be face to face. Yeah. I mean, you can do it through their videos or their books and things like that. I mean, just to learn from them from their written articles or anything like that. So that being said, um, is there like a, a must read book that you recommend or a top five list of books that you recommend reading? Top five? Oh, well, let me let me tell you guys. I have one book that really changed the game for me. Russell Branson book, Expert Secret. Guys, this is a game changer right here. This is one of the things I recommend you guys get if you're, uh, you, you truly want to put yourselves out there. It really breaks down how to do a webinar, right? It really breaks down on how to uh, uh, sell using uh, webinars. And uh, I want to mention this too. Webinars are, are are still works, okay? A lot of people still use webinars, but you got to understand nowadays people don't have the attention span that they had, you know, five, seven years ago. So having long 45 minutes to an hour webinars, right? It, it really doesn't work like it used to. So if you can condense your webinar to... Uh, 20 minutes, half an hour is you're going to have a better chance of capturing your prospect's attention because, again, uh, uh, people have you know things happening in their lives where they can't spend or they don't want to spend that amount of time uh, on a webinar, right? Unless you're giving out valuable, valuable information and you're really capturing your prospect's attention, but still, people don't want to spend an, an hour or more on a webinar. So try to con condense it down and really. Uh, Russell Branson breaks that down in, in that book. Yeah, I'm actually in the middle of reading dot com secrets. Um, Expert secrets next. Yeah, <laughs> actually have that right right next to my dot uh, com secrets book as well. Um, I'm actually go also going through the the newer book, the copywriter secrets. Yeah, which which is a lot of value there too. Like, yeah, I got to get um, that. Yeah, it's um, definitely um, he simplifies. Well, it er, all the information is already there. He just directs you to, you know, questions of what your post or your email marketing or whatever you're gonna uh, post is gonna be directly to your target audience. Like you have to think of your your leads as actually people. So yeah, I mean it's, it's simple, but it's just a good reminder saying that yeah, you, you're, that's the mindset you have to go. Or yeah. do while you're actually creating that content. Mm -hmm. So <clears throat> can't wait till my book arrives. When when do you order? Um, I haven't ordered it yet. I have to order it. I have to order it. I have to order it. I, see. I will. Um, this week sometimes for sure. <clears throat> so John Robinson said, "Can't wait until his book arrives." <laughs> Which book are we talking about? Expert Secrets. Um, and and John. Let us know if you have any questions, and we'll definitely be able to answer that for you. So currently, Vinny, what, what tools and resources are you currently using for your business? Um, well, I, I, don't, I used to have ClickFunnels. I don't have ClickFunnels anymore. But uh, I, I definitely I use uh, Kartra right now, Frank's current uh, platform. And uh, just to build my, my websites, my lead capture pages, and, and also I like the 
fact that it has an autoresponder attached to it. Um, and uh, the email delivery rates are pretty high with that platform. So that's one of the reasons why I use it. But uh, you definitely have to have an email autoresponder if you're doing any type of business online. Again, that's the main tool that you need um, to, um, if you truly want to be successful. Uh, some other tools that I, I, I use, uh, I use a tool to rank my YouTube videos called Tube Rank Machine. Uh, it's been out for a number of years, uh, but I use that to uh, target keywords, uh, see what videos uh, and, and tags that people are using. And uh, that's another tool that I use in my business. So those are the two main tools that I use uh, as of right now. I see. Um, so the other thing is, um, so the reason why I saw you in YouTube was because I was searching on this um, email list building um, system that you introduced me to. So if you want to talk a little bit about that, we can uh, we can definitely talk about that. Okay. Yeah. So um, <clears throat> I decided to. Um, well, it was brought to my attention through a Facebook post. Uh, a friend of mine named John um, was talking about a new program that was coming out that is going to help you build your email list um, by leveraging the efforts of other people and. I said to myself, this is going to be truly amazing. It also offers uh, four income streams within inside the platform. OK, so um, it, when I seen the webinar that Matthew presented, it really blew my mind. OK, because I said this is what people really need. OK, if you're if you're involved in affiliate marketing and list building like you should be, uh, this is a no brainer because it's going to help you build your email list a lot faster um, because he, the, I mean, the program is so, so simple because everything is done for you. Okay, so you have List Leverage, which is a List Leverage mem membership. And inside that membership, uh, there's uh, courses and products you can purchase, email swipes, webinars, <laughs> uh, those type of products. Um, but what makes this program key is that every fifth lead your team generates is passed up to you. Okay, so this is going to help you build your email list a lot faster than you doing it on your own. Uh, but also every fifth sales also passed up to you also. Okay, um, but it includes, um, it teaches you how to build your email list. It comes with an email autoresponder with SendShark and it also uh, has traffic built in it through Traffic Authority. Okay, Traffic Authority is a uh, online solo ad provider, okay, that offers top tier traffic um, for the US and Canada. All right, so um, with that traffic source, guys, I can let you know that I received two sales within my first week from Traffic Authority. Now, that doesn't always happen, and that shouldn't be your main focus when you're driving traffic with solo ads. It does happen, but your main focus is to build your email list, okay, of top tier quality traffic to build that no like trust, okay? So people would have to understand that these are real people that you're dealing with when you're building your email list. So you have to treat them as such and really um, build that relationship. Like you, you build a relationship with someone you meet uh, out in the real world, you wanna do the same thing with your email list, okay? Let them know about you, right? Offer valuable content that's gonna help them, right? When, once you do that, you become real to people, right? That builds, again, that no like, trust, and people are going to spend money with you. So uh, List Leverage is a way for you to build your email list fast and also make uh, high-ticket commissions and residual uh, income with the system, guys. The system is truly, truly powerful, and I'm sure uh, Bobby's already building his email list with this system. Yeah, I know it's uh, not good to ask, but I'm just curious. I want to ask now. <laughs> yeah. So how long have you been in that list leverage system and what kind of results were did you get already? Sure, sure. Um, I've been in list leverage um, when it first got started, guys, because, uh, again, um, once I see an opportunity, 
I don't pass it up. I take advantage of it immediately. So I was involved in the beginning. Uh, so far, for three weeks, guys, I've made over $6,000, and I have uh, about $1,100 in, in monthly re reoccurring income with this system, okay, in just three weeks. Wow, that's nuts. <laughs> yeah. Um, cool, man. So uh, I guess the other question is, if you were to start all over again, what would you do differently? Like any lessons that you learned or if someone were to, be, were to begin like today, what would you okay. be their advice, your advice? Um, my advice is simple, guys. Build your email list, okay? If you're not building your email list, you're wasting your time online because you, you're not building your following. You're not building that relationship with people. Uh, you don't have a way to follow up with, with your prospects, okay? And people forget about you immediately. So you have to constantly be in people's faces in order to remind them that, hey, I'm here. I have a business opportunity that you may be interested in. I know life happens, but hey, I'm here. You have to let them know you're there every single day. So one of the things I would do differently in the beginning, which I didn't do, was get an autoresponder and start building my email list, guys. This is key if you truly want to be successful online, okay? If you really want to make the type of income you see other people making uh, fast, it's because they have an email list. They already have an audience, okay? You just can't think you're going to come online and you're going to, the first business you're going to join, you're going to make $10,000 in a month. It's just, it doesn't happen that way. Okay? It's going to take time. This is a real business that you have to uh, really nurture and build that relationship and you're going to have to spend money in your business in the beginning to get it to a point where you want it to get to. But eventually you will get to that point where you can hop into any affiliate offer or anything that you want to do, because now you have an email list of 10,000 people, 20,000 people. And um, once you send an offer to them, somebody out of, the, out of your list is going to say, hey, this is something I'm interested in. They're going to take advantage of it. And guess what? You're going to get paid. So that's what I would do differently in the beginning was build my email list. And that's what I recommend to everyone. Uh, start building your email list early, okay? Early, early, early in the game. And also start making YouTube videos. Start making videos. Video marketing is key. Um, you, you just have to be out there and put yourself out there because people want to see who you are. And, and that's how people are going to find you a lot faster, right? When they're able to see your face, they, they're able to get to know you, they're able to get to like you, see your personality. Because again, you're not going to relate to everyone, right? Everyone's not going to relate to you. And you want to attract people to you who, who like you for who you are uh, because of the value that you offer. All right. And uh, your target market is not any and everyone. All right. It may be a select few, but out of your target mar market, there are a seven seven billion people in the world out of those seven billion people you have at least a million people that that want to do business with you you just have to find those one million people wait wait you're saying you're not going to target all seven billion people why not <laughs> no just, <laughs> there's no way <laughs> i want all of it man i'm greedy no but um things that uh you, you said stuck to me i agree as well so definitely start your youtube channel because <clears throat> If you guys don't realize, YouTube is part of Google. And so Google's one of the biggest, if not the biggest search engines in the world, right? Yes. And YouTube's just, it's pretty much Google for videos, so yes. video marketing. So definitely start that. Um, I know the, the industry I was in before, I was making tutorial videos of how to do things. And I, yeah, you're right. People will, will, even if they don't subscribe to you, they'll see you, they'll comment, and they'll, if you do it right, um, you, you direct them towards your either your landing page or your Facebook group. Um, and like like I said, guys, you get more eyeballs on you and more eyeballs into your your world, essentially. Yes. And <clears throat> the other thing was, so to build the your email list is number one. Uh, if I knew that in the beginning, I, I would have had a longer list, to be yeah. honest. Yes. Um, yeah. So, what do you recommend? Like, do you recommend doing paid ads, like solo ads, or organic, or YouTube, for someone that's beginning today? How? What's the best way to build the list? 
Okay, so the best way to build your list, the first thing I would do is say, uh, it depending on, depending on what you're offering, okay? So if you're in network marketing, you're in affiliate marketing, or what, whatever product or service you're offering online, what uh, is a solution to people's problems? So think about a solution that you can offer of value to your audience. Okay, so think about a solution to a problem you can offer your audience of value. So I will put together maybe a, a quick, short PDF, right, on a solution to a problem, all right? So um, it can be something as simple as how to upload videos to YouTube. I promise you, there's tons and tons of people out there that do not, have, do, do not know how to upload videos to YouTube. And it's the easiest thing in the world, but some people just don't know how to do it. So if you put together a tutorial, it can be a video tutorial, it can be a PDF, how to upload videos to YouTube. Uh, you could offer that to people in exchange for the name and email address. Okay, so that's what I would do. I'll put together a lead magnet. I will offer that in exchange for their name and the email address. And I would promote that uh, using solo ads. I'll promote that using YouTube videos. Okay, so you want to have a free way and you also want to have a paid way to advertise your, <clears throat> your offer. Okay, something that, something that you're giving away for value. And also, if you have a Facebook um, a page, I would put that on your Facebook page. I would also do uh, Facebook ads. Okay. So those are some of the ways that uh, I will start off by building my uh, email list, okay? Videos, solo ads, uh, Facebook, Facebook ads. Wow, nice, man. If, I wish I met you when before I started. <laughs> but um, <clears throat> you're right. So that's something as simple as uploading a YouTube video. Like you, you'd be surprised what, what people don't know. So yes. what I realize is <clears throat> someone knows, everyone knows something, right? Yeah. Something is easy that comes easy to you. Yes. Believe it or not, other people don't know what you know. So that's right. The simplest thing like how to create an email autoresponder, how to set up email autoresponder. Yeah. People don't know how, how to do that. So if you make a video and post it on YouTube, it's golden. Like people it's golden. will. You're going yeah. to attract people to you, right? People who exactly. like you for your personality, they like you for who you are, they like the way you present, all right? Uh, you Again, you attract different people to you. So it's just a way to start building your following and building your list. Again, you can make a, a video on anything. And one of the things that I teach is, uh, I call it LIT, L-I-T. You learn something, okay? You go to YouTube and you type in, uh, how to make a YouTube thumbnail, okay? You learn how to do it, you implement it in your own business, okay? And then now you're able to teach it, okay? So once you implement it in your own business, now you can make a video, uh, how to make a YouTube thumbnail, and this is gonna attract people to you. Guaranteed, guys, guaranteed. I don't care if there's a million videos out there on how to make a YouTube thumbnail, people will click on your video and watch your video for you, for who you are and how you present it. Yeah, definitely. It's a completely different world out there. It's, it's yeah. kind of crazy. You just, we just have to, you know, go ahead and create the content for people. And it's like, like they say, once you, once you build it, people will come, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's how that line is. <clears throat> but, um, yeah, so another question is like how if they're interested in learning more about you or reaching out to you what's the best way to reach out to you Vinny? uh best way to reach out to me is on my uh facebook page at partner with vinny uh if you so if you type in partner with vinny i'll, I'll definitely pop up on facebook uh, you can reach me there you can message me on there that's one of the best ways uh i don't have a lot of time uh, because again i, I run a business offline. I have a family, three kids. So, but I will get back to you eventually. I will get back to you. But that's one of the best ways to reach me. So yeah, just shoot me that in a messenger, and I'll post it in the description. And okay. also, um, 
people are like you as well. They're busy with family, other businesses, their full time job. Like, how do you manage all that? Um, really, I plan it out. You know, you, you have to have a plan. You have to get up every day and say, uh, you know, I used to get up in the morning and I didn't have a plan of action. I didn't know what I was going to do throughout the day. I knew I had to go to work. I knew I had to go to do certain things at my job. Uh, but when it came to my business, um, I didn't really focus on my business after work. Okay, I didn't have a plan of action. So you have to get up with a purpose every single day. So write, you can just write it down on a piece of paper. I have a notebook that I keep by my bed and I'll write down the things that I have to do the next day. And I'll try to accomplish all the things that I want to accomplish either uh, for that day, for my business, for my family, whatever I have to do. But I try to do the most important thing first. And then all the time, guys, you can't kick yourself in the butt if you're not able to complete that, that list. Okay? It's just not going to happen sometimes. Again, life happens. Um, but make sure you get up with a purpose and you plan out your day. Okay, So that's key. You have to plan out your day and uh, you have to make time. Even if you don't have a lot of time, make time because um, doing these simple daily disciplines, guys, leads to success. OK, if you if you're procrastinating and you're 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 skipping days and you're, you're just not doing what you're supposed to be doing, um, then you're not going to see the type of results that you want to see. And you're not going to get closer to your goal. It's just like working out. All right. If you say, hey, I'm going to go to the gym five days a week. Right. And then. You do that for two weeks and then you start to fall off, guys. Uh, you're going to go back into the same routine. So if you do your, your workout plan every single day for 90 days straight, have that mental discipline that, hey, I'm going to do this every single day. and this, I'm going to make time for it no matter what. Guys, you will see results guaranteed. I totally agree. <clears throat> so before... I did this challenge called the One Phone Away Challenge. Yeah. Um, they, they challenged me to pretty much set up my schedule, like commuting time to work, eating time, working. Yes. Like so time with family, whatever it is. And then also make time for, you know, your online business. So I separate like one to two to even three hours, depending on the day, how busy the day is, just to focus on my online business, whether it's writing emails, whether it's following up on leads, whether it's creating content, whether it's this interview, right? Yes. And I plug it into my phone and it will remind me, like, oh, I have to prepare yeah. my interview with Vinny. I have that actually from last night. <clears throat> and another thing that I learned was, and what you touched on was, you published for 90 days. What does that mean? Meaning you, you either created content, video, or post, um, so uh, I create I created one video every single day for ninety days straight. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that 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 that's crazy because <clears throat> what they challenged us to do was publish at least one day uh, every day for three hundred sixty five days, which is crazy. Wow. <laughs> whether it's whether it's you writing a blog, you're okay. creating a video, or doing like a podcast. Yeah. It's like at least one one a day. That that was crazy. And that, and guess that, what? And if, if you're not for, uh, comfortable with the camera or typing or on audio, after 365 days straight, you, you're going to have to be comfortable. You, you'll you're find your own groove. Yes. You keep it going. You find your own groove. You get comfortable. Yeah. And you're like, okay, this is just like brushing my teeth now. Yeah, it so, is. It is. So if anyone's out there who's afraid of doing that, uh, you can reach out to us. We can facilitate like doing a live every day or something. Like even doing a Facebook Live. Like I know YouTube, you would have edit videos and things like that. But YouTube, I mean, Facebook Live, you just go press a button on your phone while you're walking or doing whatever, yeah. and just go live. Yeah, that's true. I mean, it, it, it's just that simple, guys. It's just that simple. And uh, you you may be thinking to yourself, well, what do I talk about? What do I do? Well, plan it out, right? Uh, model what other successful people are doing. If you see people making videos. Uh, YouTube videos or um, uh, Facebook lives, listen to what they're talking about, right? And then model what they're doing. Don't exactly steal what they're doing, but model their example and use it in your own business, okay? And uh, this is really going to help you uh, to put that content out there because that's the only way you're truly going to attract people to you, right? You may not see a ton of results in the beginning, 
But I promise you, if you do it for 30 days straight, people are going to take notice because you're doing something consistently, right? Consistency is key for business. Uh, I, I know I mentioned that a lot, but that's what changed everything around for me, guys, is being consistent. People like consistency. They like to know that you're going to be around. You're not here one day and you're gone tomorrow, but people like consistency. So if you can show discipline, which a lot of people don't have, all right, that's why people are successful. It's not because they are, uh, uh, they have some special power or anything like that, all right? They just do simple disciplines and they are disciplined in their daily activities and that's what makes them successful. Hey guys, um, so uh, I know I you had a offer prepared, and no one's yeah. doing, but they'll catch it on the replay. So let's tell us more about that. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do, guys. Um, so Bobby's involved with List Leverage. So everyone that decides to get involved with List Leverage with Bobby, okay, and that's building your email list. What I'm going to do is, guys, I'm, I'm going to give you two weeks free of Traffic School Co-op, okay? So you're going to get an additional clicks uh, for your business with Traffic School Co-op. So you'll be invited to the group for free. Uh, every day, uh, there's a different video on different trainings on ways to generate traffic to help you get more leads and more sales in your business. So you'll get that information totally free, but you also will receive uh, solo ad clicks that are distributed equally among its members. Okay, so everyone that participates, uh, we're able to purchase more clicks, but you'll get two weeks free. So that's the offer. So get started with Bobby immediately. If you need to watch the, the video, the webinar, Bobby will direct you to that video or webinar. Awesome, man. Uh, and just in case that wasn't enough, I have something to add as well. <laughs> Nice. I have this course that um, for affiliate marketers or any type of internet marketing, um, uh, a course that will show you how to make your first $1,000 in commissions. And it's a course of like 10 plus hours of videos of um, pretty much how, how to get traffic, how to build a funnel, and any, any anywhere between social media like Facebook and YouTube. And I'll share that with you guys as well. Nice. Free, yeah. It's a. They say it's a four hundred ninety-seven dollar value because that's how much this person sells it for. But I have uh, rights to give it out. So, nice. if you guys interested? Like I said, join. You get the two weeks of traffic school co-op and this free course. Uh, this course I'm giving out away for free. Cool. All right. So we come up in the hour. Um, anything you wanna? leave with our viewers here yeah um guys take action that that's one of the things i have to i want to get across to you guys is whatever you're thinking about don't overthink um getting started just get started and start to implement the things that we are telling you to do because that's the only way um that you're going to start seeing results in your business by taking action okay you can watch a million videos on how to do something and contemplate how to do it before you actually do it. But the only way to truly learn how to do it is to take action, right? It's, it's really a, a learn to do business, not, not a do to learn business, right? You gotta, by taking action and learning to do this business, that's how you learn and you become comfortable and you're gonna get results. So take action, all right? That's what I wanna tell you guys, whatever you do in life, take action immediately and you can work out the kinks in the roadblocks later but take action immediately i have to totally agree um i have other mentors that did the same thing you know yeah. bobby just take imperfect action imperfect action is better than no action yes like they always say yes i'm like all right then um if you guys want to follow up with Vinny, like i said i'm going to post his contact info yeah. in the description and if you want to take up on his offer just let me know uh, I will also post a link of what he's talking about and that's it guys all right thanks Vinny for your time and I know you're you have a busy Sunday so. yes
Thanks, Bobby, for having me. I really appreciate this, and uh, you take care. All right, man. Take it easy. All right. All right. Bye.